Hello, my name is Sarah Alden. And my name is Samuel Torres. And we are teaching artists. Today, we are going to explore the bomba rhythm from Puerto Rico. This video is part of the Kennedy Center Education's online collection, Teaching Artists Presents, where teaching artists from all over the country lead arts activities that you can do from the comfort of your own home. Hey, Samuel, do you think that music can communicate without words? Hmm. I am communicating, and you seem to have responded. Wow, what was that? How did you do that? Well, I've been playing percussions since I was 14 years old back in my hometown of Bogota, Colombia, and I love to make people dance with my music. That's beautiful. I also love to play music for people to dance to. I grew up in Ohio playing the violin. But what you did was different. What was that you played? It's one of my favorite rhythms. It's called the bomba, and it's from the island of Puerto Rico. It's one of the most famous rhythms from Latin America. Do you like it too? I would love to teach it to you. In this video, we're going to create our own bomba instruments, and we're going to teach you how to play the basic bomba patterns, like this. Bomba is an Afro-Caribbean rhythm from Puerto Rico. Bomba was created on the sugar plantations by enslaved Africans who were brought against their will to Puerto Rico by the Spaniards and were forced to work for the rum trade. The enslaved Africans came from different parts of Africa and music became a way to communicate. They used music and dance as a common language. While we are focusing on the rhythm and how it can express feelings like happiness in your daily life, we should acknowledge the important relationship between dancers and the musicians in the history of the bomba. Shall we meet the instruments now? Oh yeah! This is the bomba barrel, or barril de bomba. These are the quad which are two sticks used on the side of the barrel. And these are the maracas, which are gourds filled with seeds. These are the instruments that are used to create the bamba. Now it's your turn to find these sounds in your house. First, we need the maracas. We need something that can shake and has that seed-like sound. Like the pepper shaker? Perfect! The qua has a wooden sound, and they are essential sticks. Could we use pencils? Yes, perfect. And last, lastly, the barriles. You can use a hard surface to get that low sound. This table. Yeah, that's great. Great, now please pause this video and go find your three sounds. The... Maracas. The... Quas. And the... Barriles. What's the first pattern you're going to teach us? Let's begin with the maracas. This is a pattern that keeps the whole bomba together. It's simple, but it's very important part. Grab your shakers. Place your shaker in your right hand. It should be horizontal with your thumb in front. Now, using your wrist to move the shaker back and forth saying the word pizza. Pizza, 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 pizza. Let's, let's try a little faster. Pizza, 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 pizza. Now it's time for the qua. Grab your sticks or pencils. Place a pencil on each hand and make an X. With the stick in your right hand, Tap on the left stick with this rhythm. Say, play the bomba now. 
Our last pattern features the beautiful barriles. Find a hard surface and we will make two sounds. The first sound is called the slap. We hit the center of the drum with our full hand. Slap. 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 The second sound is called the open tone and we will use only our four fingers together. Try with me. Yes. Now let's try combinating these two sounds. Three and four. Slap, open, slap, open, slap, open, slap, open. Awesome. We have the sounds. So now let's try the pattern like this, the bomba pattern. Notice my hand placement and we will say the rhythm pi with applesauce. Pie with applesauce. Pie with applesauce. Pie with applesauce. Our slaps will be on the word pie and the syllable ap of apple. Our open tone will be in all of the other syllables and words. Follow me and alternate your hands and repeat. Three and four and pie with applesauce. Play with my right hand the quad pattern. Play the bomba now. Play the bomba now. And with my left hand I will play the maracas. And you will play the barriles. Pie with applesauce. Pie with applesauce. So for those of you who are at home, try teaching a pattern to your family or a caregiver and try playing them together. Choose one of the following rhythms. Play the bomba now. Play the bomba now. Pizza, 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 pizza. Pie with applesauce. Pie with applesauce. Okay, here we go. One, two, ready, go. Pie. Play the bomba now, play the bomba now. Pizza, 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 pizza. One, two, three, four, stop. So, let's see if we can make someone in our house dance to our bomba rhythm. But how about if I don't have anybody in my house? Mm. Well, sometimes I play just for myself and that makes me really happy. I love to accompany my daily activities with rhythm, like washing the dishes, or brushing my teeth, or sweeping the floor. <laughs> I have noticed that about you. You will always have so much fun cleaning the house. Share your bomba music and be happy. Okay, well, let's play the bomba. Here we go. One, two, ready, go. Play the bomba now. Play the bomba now. Play with applesauce. Play with applesauce. Play with applesauce. One, two, three, four, stop. I hope you had as much fun as we did. Now that you've learned the bomba pattern, play anytime you need to pick me up. Or you just want to express yourself without words. Hey, okay, bye.